there today is Megan and this fabulous sea lion you hear down here in the water is Quinty. Can we say hi, Quinty? Uh, She's like, I got my cup. That's all I need. Now, Quinty being California sea lion, she is 12 years old. Actually, all four of our sea lions here at Marine Life, every single one of their birthdays are in June. So she just turned 12 this June. How many of you think 12 is old for a sea lion? How many of you think 12 years old is young and sprightly for a sea lion? How many of you have no idea 12 years old is great, young, old, whatever, that's totally all right. Quincy being 12 years old is pretty much in the prime of her life. They can live on average in the wild from around 15 to 20 years old. That's absolutely right, Quincy. Let's give her a round of applause. Now, Quincy being 12 years old, she has lived her entire life under human care. So she started at a zoo. She was born in the Royal Art Zoo in Amsterdam. And she came to us in 2008. So she has been with us for a long time. Now, with a new sea lion coming and joining us here at Marine Life, part of what we do every single day is really important, not only for the health of our animals, but in their training as well. We have to build a relationship based on trust with them in order for them to do the years that we ask. So that is what a lot of people want to know about us here at Marine Life, is the how and why we train our animals. Oh. So we train our animals because of their health. It's very important that our animals are healthy in order to do any training with them to begin with. So every single day we give a really good body examination over our animals. So Megan, right now what she's doing, she's checking over Quinty's eyes, checking her ears and her mouth. Wow. Look at Quinty's mouth. What do you notice about her teeth? What color were they? They were brown, almost black. How many of you brushed your teeth this morning? <laughs> I should see way more hands going up right now in the audience, people that brush their teeth. That's right, she gets her teeth brushed every day as well. But for a sea lion to have black, brownish teeth, that is healthy, because that means they eat a lot of fish. The more fish they eat, the more that stuff builds on their teeth. But we do brush it every single day. And what she's doing right now over Quinty is checking over her body. She's looking for any bumps, scrapes, bruises, cuts, things like that. We can also tell by their sea lion if we have them do these behaviors for us, whether or not they're molting. So Quinty right now is molting a little bit, so she's getting some new fur on her body. But let's give her a round of applause for that. For Quinty to do that for us is very trustworthy because Whenever an animal rolls onto their back like that and exposes their stomach, that's usually a very vulnerable position. That's where a lot of animals get eaten. Now, Quinty here, being under human care, she doesn't have to worry about predators, but her counterparts in the wild do, especially being a young pup. There are two main predators of the California sea lion. I'll give you a hint for one of them. It is really big and it's black and white. What is it? Orca. Orca, orca. An orca whale. That is exactly right. An orca whale is a predator of a California sea lion. And there's one more predator. But I think Megan might have trained Quinty to show us what that predator is. So she's going to have Quinty give us a little bit of a hint. So keep your eye out in the water. Oh my goodness. Megan, are you scared? A little bit scared? Don't worry. It's just Quinty. But that is a shark, absolutely right. Sharks will eat young California sea lion. Let's get Quincy for out of applause. He's a fantastic shark impersonator. <laughs> now, how many of you were excited today to come see our seal show? Oh my goodness, that might have been my most pumped up crowd so far. Well, take a look over there at that sign. It says, Sea Lions Rock. So unfortunately here at Marine Life, we don't have any seals. We only have sea lions. There's some really big main differences between a seal and a sea lion. And we're gonna help show those right now. So when you look at Quincy's body, the way she's jumping up and down with Megan right now, look at her back flippers. So with her back flippers, oh yeah, she's got those strong front flippers too. They're much longer than a seal's. 